power of the Upper West Region by joining members of the Reverend Paul Edu Methodist Church at Wa. The day coincided with her 69th birthday. The chaplain, very Reverend Isaac Efumba, admonished politicians to conduct their campaigns without insults and acrimony. Professor Nana Jinopokwajima said the NDC is conducting a peaceful campaign and encouraged others to do the same. Professor Pokwajima then called on the Busio Kroro, Isaka Zenge Tenji, and his elders at Lumbusi. Kroro Tenji said the area has benefited a lot from development projects executed by the NDC. He asked the party to do more if it won power again. The NDC government and they were in power, right from PNDC up to NDC. We have had something from them in the, in the sense of development projects. Classical among them, I would say, is educational facilities, health facilities, agriculture, what have you. And uh, the latest big one has been the senior high school that the former president, John Mahama, came and commissioned. Professor Nana Jinopoka Ajiman assured all that the next NDC government would grant those requests. The NDC running mate was welcomed by supporters and sympathizers at PINA. She condemned alleged vote buying by some candidates and said the money being distributed should have been used rather for development. We take care with hospital, with everything we need, so that when we go to our office, which is the market, we can also work and work well. Because we want our lives to progress, because we want our country to progress, we will vote for His Excellency John Dramani Mahama, and then we'll also vote for our brother. The NDC running mate also addressed a gathering at Nandom where she said an NDC government would need majority seats in parliament to implement its People's Manifesto. She urged the electorate to vote for Mr. John Mahama and the parliamentary candidate Dr. Richard Kuri.